Rory, you've committed to another year at town. How pleased are you to have your future sorted? Yeah, I'm delighted. Um, obviously, um, the, the last season has been a bit, bit up and down, I think, from, from a personal point of view, and I think collectively as well. Um, so it's something that uh, we want to try and build on as much as possible, um, take all the positives from, from last season and, and keep moving them forward, but equally look at, at, at the sort of stage of the season where we sort of fell short a little bit, um, look at how we can sort of rectify that and um, keep the club moving forward. Have these last couple of weeks given you a bit of a chance to reflect on the season that's just gone and evaluate it? Yeah, um, I think when, when it comes to the end of the season it's important that obviously first and foremost you, you look at trying to just switch off a little bit and, and start recuperating as such but equally not, not completely close the door on the season uh, just because it's finished. Um, it's a good time to look at all the positive things that have happened uh, throughout the season and, and, and the negatives as well. Um, I, think, um, I think the season as a whole has, has been a bit of a roller coaster ride but um, I'm sure it's, it happens um, quite a lot, um, so it's something that I, I sort of look back on from, like I said, from a personal point of view, but equally collectively, and see how we can uh, build on that. I guess one of the negatives has to be the injury that will drop for a few months. Did that come at a bad time as well? It felt like you were just really settling into the side, things were going well on the pitch. Yeah, I think whenever you get injured, it's, it's disappointing and, and, and frustrating, um, and to miss a sort of period of time as, as what I did was, was even more frustrating, as you said. Um, I think I played about nine or ten games at the time. Um, we had a good start, obviously when, when everything's going well, everyone wants to be out on the pitch and, 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 and involved when, when, when you're winning and, and, and took top of the league, I think we were um, at a spell, so it was really frustrating from, from that point of view, it just sort of like settled in, um, I think you start to try and build relationships up during pre-season um, on and off the pitch and they were all, all building, so yeah, from, from a personal point of view it was really frustrating, you're just hoping that you can get back as quickly as possible and, and start having an influence uh, back on the squad, um, both on and off the pitch. Looking ahead to the pre-season coming up, I guess that's got to be the aim again. We obviously did something back to have started the season so well. Yeah, that's it. Um, pre-season is always tough. Um, I think that, that there's no hiding away from that. Um, but uh, as you said, it's, I think it's about building them sort of relationships on and off the pitch. As, as I found last year, I was new in the door, so um, for how welcome everybody made me feel um, that that's a massive battle and I think pre is a, a big part of that. It's about um, getting, getting to know everyone, um, getting your fitness in which is obviously um, a given I think um, and, and just, just getting used to how everybody is, like the styles of play, how people are on and off the pitch so it's, it's, it's a good time because you know for the season that's coming you're going to be spending a lot of time with each other whether it's at the training ground, whether it's sat on the bus, whether it's overnight trips and, and things like that so um, it's, it's the whole thing I think gone are the days of it just being running until you're sick and, yeah. and, and that's that, um, it's building uh, that sort of rapport with everyone and make sure that the whole squad's uh, knitted together. We're expecting quite a lot of new faces over the summer, is that exciting as a player on the pitch to, to see who's coming in and, and welcoming these new faces? Yeah of course it is I think, well, equally when, when somebody comes in um, it's, it's something new, it's, it might be something different that some of us have never seen or, or worked work with before and um, as you said um, having the opportunity to meet new people and welcome them to the club just like I was welcomed uh, last season, that, that's something that, that I, I took massively from, from last season, um, I think it shows that um, wherever you are, wherever you've been in football, you, you, you can always learn something. Um, so yeah, it's something that we're looking forward to. Um, a challenge that hopefully lads will see that when players do come in, it's it's that competitive edge that lads are going to start fighting for their places, but equally make sure that when someone needs a, a, a bit of a helping hand, everyone's there. Great, thank you. Cheers.